What's up, fanboys and fangirls? Welcome to another trailer reaction video for fanboysanonymous.com. I'm your host, Tony Mango, and if you didn't check out the previous video, then a uh, little breakdown here. We got a bunch of different things that have happened from San Diego Comic-Con that dropped a little bit earlier today that I'm sort of catching up on. I just took care of the Justice League action one, and I figured now I would dive into the Marvel Netflix side of things, and since it's the next one that's coming out, Luke Cage is first up. So... You guys should know how movie trailer and TV trailer reaction videos go by now. Pretty much just going to click play on this and get my live reaction, my first thoughts of our first real look at Luke Cage. So without further ado, let's go ahead and click play. Take my advice, brother. You should be out there helping people like them other fellas down in Dallas. Three things to say the same thing. She was right. Continuity's good. I'm kind of digging this, okay? <laughs> this has a, a different feel to it than the other ones, and I'm loving it. <laughs> Yo, I want him to be such a badass like this the entire time. I never really liked Luke Cage as much in the comics and stuff, but I'm loving him so far in the, the Netflix series. <laughs> I love how he's just breaking the shit out of everything and... Now things are getting serious. I'm just getting started. Dude, I'm so in. I'm so in on this. It's ridiculous. Um, yeah, I mean, Luke Cage was my favorite part of the Jessica Jones uh, section. May well, maybe not my favorite part, my absolute favorite part. He was definitely up there. I really, really was loving Luke Cage. I actually don't even want them to do a second season of Jessica Jones. We haven't even seen this season of Luke Cage yet, and I want them to do a combo thing, just Luke Cage and Jessica Jones together. Maybe call it Heroes for Hire if you're not going to go that route with the whole Defenders thing. But, man, I'm loving this so far. This is really cool. Uh, it seems like a lot of fun that they're going to play up with this idea that he's just kind of walking through. He's just, you know, the bullets are bouncing off of him. He doesn't give a shit. He's, you know, ripping off sides of the walls and stuff like that. I'm, uh, I mean, you can tell, big smile on my face. I think that this is going to be really cool. Um, a lot better than the Jessica Jones thing, I think, as long as they end up having a good enough story to go along with it, which we really didn't really get all that much for with this. It's sort of just a, uh, hey, look, Luke Cage is fucking awesome, and he's fucking awesome, so <laughs> what the hell? Why not? You can't dislike this, right? Um, I'm curious what you guys have to say about this, though. Leave your comments below, as I mentioned before, and I'll be mentioning again. Just make sure you hit that subscribe button, follow us on Facebook and Twitter, and keep checking out fanboysanonymous.com for more things coming your way, whether it's Marvel Netflix stuff, outside of the Netflix things for Marvel, the DC things, or anything else, really, that we're going to be doing over the next couple weeks, months, years, however long you follow us, hopefully forever. But, uh... Thanks for checking this out, everybody. We've got two more to go, and I'm thinking that Iron Fist is going to be next, so go ahead and click on that one, and I'll see you there.